What is up, ladies and gentlemen? I have good news and bad news. Good news is finally going to get to open up some of the Rarity 2 collect or Rarity Collection 2. Bad news is I'm going to slow down on opening Yu-Gi-Oh! product. There's just... They make so much. I I have a limited amount of money I can spend. And uh, Konami's printing stuff almost monthly, sometimes twice a month. I can't do it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Look in the sets, see if there's anything that I'm interested in. If there is, then we might open some stuff. For instance, uh, Japanese new Rush uh, Rush Duel Japanese set has a crazy Dark Magician Girl art. I might get a couple boxes of that. Uh, with that being said, so there's no more weekly videos, so Pokemon's probably going to become Friday and Dragon Ball still be Monday. Uh, Dragon Ball. I, I buy all that stuff myself, and I love the Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball is one of my favorite things forever. I love Yu-Gi-Oh! It's just there's just too much. And Pokemon, awesome CCG, allows me to open up packs, so I don't actually have to spend money on that. So, if there's a card shop, shop out there that wants to, you know, just donate some stuff and I'll bring the product back to you, cool. If not... It's just going to be an every now and then kind of thing. Probably some Japanese stuff because they usually have some really cool exclusive things. Kind of like the obelisk that I gave away and other things as well. But I'm sorry, guys. I, I do love Yu-Gi-Oh! It's just it's too much right now. Uh, it's, it's just a lot. Especially right now because the next couple months is like heavy con season. Next month alone, I'm not getting them myself, but I'm getting... I'm going to have a whole bunch of Dragon Ball and uh, Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't think any Pokemon, but mainly Dragon Ball and Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, oh, even a Bleach card. I'm going to get autographs um, for those. But, guys, we will be still doing YouTube, uh, YouTube and TikTok shorts. So, don't worry. I'll still be opening some stuff. It just won't be as much as normal. Uh, and with that being said, I'm actually going to snag a couple of these packs. There's only 18 packs per box we're gonna take a couple from each box one two three we'll take four from each box one two three four no we'll do five from each box <laughs> um that'll also kind of reduce this this down from 36 packs to 31 one two three four five so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten all right, these 10 packs, uh, look forward to the YouTube shorts and TikToks. The rest of this is being opened in this video. Um, I am going to do a whole video. I'm not, I'm not going to break it down. It's going to be all one video. Uh, I do believe I still have one more video scheduled for next week. So don't worry. We have one more weekly video before everything shifts. I am sorry, guys. Again. Now, we're going to make this look cool. Spread them out. Now, I know top cards are the Quarter Century IP Mascarina and the Apollosa. I think those are the top cards. Oh, a Rescue Cat. Foolish Burial Ultra. Very nice. Exosister Magnifica. Peaceful Planet. Ooh. Double a pack already. Phantom Knights of Break Sword. Oh, nice QCR. Uh, pressured Planet. <laughs> I I I don't like how full. Ooh, Drolin Lockbird, Secret Rare and Fusion. Where where was it? where was the sweet spot? I think this was the sweet spot. Right over the cards. <clears throat> that was a pretty good pack. First pack right out the gate a QCR. Drollin Lockbird Super Rare. Enemy Controller. Classic. Borolo Dragon. Charge. Ooh, Blue Eyes Alternative. Drollin Lockbird Ultra. Enemy Controller Secret. Jesus. <laughs> Trying to keep this stuff organized. Right? That's a regular secret. Apollosa Secret. Nice. And a Blue Eyes Alternative. I think everything's in order now. Uh, now, anybody who goes to the card shop, I will have these on me. So you guys can go through them. And uh, we can work out a deal. Mystical Space Typhoon Ultra Rare. Blue Eyes Jet Dragon Ultra. 
Ghost Mourner and Moonlit Chill. Oh, we got a QCR here. Fusion Deployment. Pearly Pretty Memory. Another good good card. Ooh. Charge of the Light Bur Brigade. At least I'm pretty sure that's a QCR. No, this is a QCR. This is a Platinum Seeker, I think. Oh, my God. They look virtually the same. Unless they're not. Unless it is a QCR, right? Am I delusional? I could be just delusional. So, QCR has the stamp on it. I think this is just a Platinum Seeker. They changed that so much. Platinum Seeker used to look like... <laughs> It looks like it was a, an error on the printing of the secret rare. All right. Soul and Luna. Come on. Try to keep them organized, guys. DD Crow. Good ultra rare. Cross out designator. Very good ultra rare. Abyss Dweller. Pot of Duality. Abyss Dweller. Cross out designator. This. Oh, IP Mascarina. That was actually. I'm not going to lie. So a lot of people give this a lot of hate, which is fair. Uh, this set's not bad. Uh, Value-wise, it has a lot of really good staple monsters, which I think a lot of people are overlooking. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to fix this so I can actually have the cards closer. Sorry, I don't have my fo focus to auto for the sheer fact that I don't like it. So we're, we're, we're going to have the cards a little closer. Just for you guys. <clears throat> Ghost Ogre Snow Rabbit. Ooh. Ulti Blue Eyes Spear Dragon. Got that. Axis Code Talker. Good Ultra Rare. Silent Swordsman. There's still some in here. Ooh, now that's a QCR. Ooh, Coral Dragon QCR. And a Bingo Machine Go. When's the last time we saw that? Was that in the the Kaiba the Kaiba set? Legendary Duelist season? No, not season. <clears throat> I think that was the Legendary Duelist Ka the uh, Kaiba set, a long time ago. Oh, Gold Sarcophagus, DD Crow Ultra Rare, Blue Eyes Jet Ultra, Blue Eyes Spirit Dragon Ultra, Rescue Cat. Ooh, QCR, TJ, Hyper, Librarian, nice QCR, ooh, a Luber Secret Rare, and a Super Rare Luber, Jesus, yeah, so the difference between this set and the Rarity Collection 1 is this has more, like, side deck monsters and stuff like that, that you were, ooh, Cosmic Cycle, that you want, whereas the first one was a lot of staple spells and traps, which are... Oh, Alti Apollosa. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Uh, where's the, er, so technically as far as, uh, utilization, the first one is definitely better, but this one's still really good. Like, I, I think people are just dogging on it too hard, hard because the real problem with it isn't what's inside of it. Cause they have a Apollosa, IP Mascarina, DD Crow, Lock and Droll. Uh, Luber, uh, Mystical Space Typhoons, Cosmic Cyclone. They have so many good cards. <clears throat> but it's really the value of the packs and the boxes that are really, what, ooh, Forbidden Lance, or what really make it uh, undesirable. Like you, ooh. Yep, Ultimate Slayer, Ultimate Seeker Rare. Yeah, so it's, even at Walmart, uh, they have three pack mini boxes that are thirty dollars that means that even msrp at, at box stores are ten dollars a pack so if you were to buy a booster box 18 packs 180 dollars so it, it it's just a lot for how much you get oh an ultimate mystical space typhoon very nice Troll and Lockbird. Go oh, Chimera's in this? That's a good one. Guardian Chimera. I didn't realize that was in here. I think that's the first one. This is a, it's, it's a good set. People are just harping on it too hard. But I understand. It's it's really the price point for 
the amount of packs, not what's in it. And if anyone actually, ooh, another ultimate rare. And if you're saying it's not the price point, you're lying to yourself and everyone else. Secret or Solemn Judgment, very nice. And Super Nimble Mega Hamster. What a name, Super Nimble Mega Hamster. <laughs> guys, what do you think of this? Uh, if you guys actually think this is a bad set, you're lying. Uh, unless you give me a definitively good reason, like for instance, uh, there's good cards in it, don't lie. I've literally pointed out several of them. Um, just tell me that you agree. Another ultimate room, nice, nice. Oh, and a QCR in the same one. Oh, it's a pearly? QCR pearly? That's epic. If you agree that it's the value per what you get, that's fair. I understand that. But if you're actually going to say there's nothing good in this set, you don't play the game. I don't even play the game, and I know that's a bold lie. I don't even play the game, and I know that'd be a lie. Ooh, ultimate rare DD Crow. Okay. Oh, my God. Ultimate rare, and then the secret ultimate rare? I didn't even realize there was two different ultimate rares. I'm not going to lie to you. Back-to-back -back DD Crows, though. That's crazy. Oh, my God. That was crazy. I'm just going to stack the two ultimate rares in the same pile. I didn't even realize there was a difference. <laughs> didn't notice until that very moment where I pulled the same card in both rarities. Pearly, very good. Cross-out designator, very good. Striking Dragon. Okay. Solemn Warning. Okay. Mind Control. Oh! Secret, uh, Platinum Secret Rare Skill Drain. Very nice. Got the, uh, Synchro Dragon Secret Rare and Book of Eclipse. We've had a, a very successful opening. We've only seen one Axis Code Talker, though. Yo, Justin, homie. Sorry, man. I know you wanted a low rarity one. We'll go through this after and we'll message him. IP Mascarena. Good ultra rare. Good ultra rare. Abyss Dweller. Ooh, Skullmeister ultimate rare. Secret. Silent Magician. Illusion of Chaos. And a super rare for that. Yo. I've seen some dud packs. We not really had any dud packs we've gotten like oh there's something in here super skill drain anti-spell fragrance oh blazing dragon ulti twin twisters <laughs> the mega hamster mind control dd crow all right all right not bad not bad i'd say overall it's pretty successful Hopefully the Yu-Gi-Oh guys want to snag a whole bunch of them. Chimera, very good. Borlo Dragon, wrong pile. <laughs> Striking Dragon, Rescue Cat. Silent Magician, Ultra Rare. Pearly. Ooh, Red Eyes Dark Dragoon, Secret Rare. And a Skill Drain QCR? Oh my god. These are, this is fire. We got a skill drain, see, platinum secret, skill drain, QCR. I mean, the IP mask arena is what we really want as a QCR. Or the, uh, ooh, cross out would be a good one. Silent Magician Ultra, Ultimate Rare. Just, just so the Yu Gi Oh guys knows if they actually watch this. Uh, there are definitely going to be some cards that I probably won't sell. Like that Silent Magician. I'm probably going to get it graded myself. I'm not going to lie. Twin Twisters, Aluber. I gotta go back through these and see which ones I actually wanna keep. Honestly, it's probably gonna be none of the playable ones that the boys want. Ugh! Pearly. Nice little memory. Little uh, Striking Dragon. DD Crow. Timeless. Forbidden Lance Ultra Rare. Nice. Rescue Cat. Skill Drain Seeker Rare. Ooh, Rescue Rabbit Platinum Secret Rare and an Aluber Super Rare. Ooh. This, this fire. This fire. I'm enjoying this right now. Like I said, 
I am probably I will also be getting some Union Arena guys. Union Arena Volume Two for Bleach is coming out I think later this month. Probably gonna get a couple boxes, do a few videos on that. Uh, I love Bleach. Uh, there is ooh, I dude I love these Ultimate Rares. Uh, I love Bleach. Union Arena does such a great job, and uh, I I'm excited to open them. I'll also be getting, I already ordered it, three boxes of the English uh, Volume 1 set for Bleach, which we opened up. I don't even want to talk about how many Japanese boxes we opened up. Too many, to be honest with you. Oh, Blazing Dragon ulti. Back to back. Oh my god. Illusion of Chaos ulti. Can we get a QCR? Can we get a QCR too? No? No, it was just too much already? I get it, I get it, I get it. Jesus, how many hits of one pack can we get? I want to get a maximum. So those are in like. So I noticed that the cards are in certain rarity spots. So I'm wondering if you can get a. Okay, there we go. Ultimate rare, trap tricks, charge. Okay, guardian, book of moon. Oh, magician soul QCR. That's gas. That's crazy. Uh, and Adam, if you watch this, you might want to hit me up on Discord before the boys get to the card shop. Because if you really want anything, let me know. Uh, you can make your brother pick it up for you. Just letting you know. Because I know you have a Dark Magician. Oh, Ultra Apollosa. I know you have a uh, Dark Magician deck, so... I'm not going to lie, I thought there was something in this. Guys, if you haven't already hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And uh, I, I, I do apologize for doing less Yu-Gi-Oh. But, just just is what it is, guys. I'm sorry. I will still be doing it, just not as much. Crystal Wing. I mean, again, unless somebody gives me stuff to open. Ooh, that's a good ultim ulti rare. Ultimate. Like, for instance, uh, Special K, VC, oh, a, a Pearly, Platinum Seeker Rare, nice, Seeker Rare Underworld, and an IP Mask Arena? Like, for instance, VC, he gives me, he'll give me stuff to open just because, why not? <clears throat> and if he gives me something to open, um, I can either do it in a couple different videos or, or one video. Haven't decided yet. Droll and Lockbird. Nice. Ulti Pearly. Woo! Oh, my God. A Luber Ultra Rare. Silent Swordsman. Oh, QCR? Who is that? Dra Dragon Phantasma? Dragon Phantasma QCR. Hell, yeah. I hope I left some hits in those packs. It's been just fire. Just absolute fire. We're going to go back and we're going to look at the QCRs and the Ultimate Rares in a second. And the uh, Platinum Seeker Rares. Boral Load. Ultimate Jet Dragon. Oh. Axis Code Talker Ultra Rare. Skill Drain Ultra Rare. Skull Meister. And Striking Dragon. Bingo, dra uh, bingo Machine Go. Guys, this is the last pack of the video. Can we get some last pack magic, guys? Can we seal it with an Apollosa or IP Masquerina QCR? I'd even take Axis Code Talker, to be honest with you. Magician Soul. Okay, Heavenly Spheres. Ultimate Rare <laughs> Blue Eyes Alternative. That's sick. Illusion of Chaos. Abyss. Tr oh, we we do have something. Oh, we got a we got a platinum or a QCR. And the last hit of the video, guys, is. Oh nope, it is Planet. Uh, what the hell does that say? Rates off. Whatever. Platinum Seeker rare. Not what we wanted, but still pretty awesome, guys. Now we're going to do a quick recap. So the ultimate rares that are like the secret ones and the regular ones, we have Blue Eyes, 
Alternative White Dragon, Jet Dragon, Purely. We have Ghost Mourner and Moonlit Chill, Trap Tricks, Illusion of Chaos, Blazing Dragon, Ancient and Ascended. I think that's a dragon. Silent Magician. I'm going to put that one on the side because I'm probably going to keep that one myself. Blazing Dragon. Skullmeister. Didi Crow. Didi Crow. Got him. I didn't even feel like reading it. Abomination's Prison. Uh, MST. Troll and Lockbird. Apollosa. Gotta love that. I'm not going to lie. That's a good one. Blue Eye Spirit Dragon. And. Uh, break sword. I think I think that was actually one of the other ones. Now we're gonna do the platinum. The the platinum. Platinum. Secret rares. Let's see what we got. We got the uh, purely pretty memory. That's a good one. Rescue bunny or rabbit. Skill drain. That was a good one. Uh, Ultimate slayer. I think that's actually good. Uh, this one. I'm not gonna bother reading. <laughs> And, uh, Charge of the Light Brigade. I uh, I wonder if that's a Tri-Brigade card, because it brings a brigade. And last but not least, the QCRs. And I believe there's five QCRs per box, so we'll, depending on how many are here. So we have the, uh, Phantasma, Phantasma, Magician's Souls, which is huge, Skill Drain, which is also huge. Uh, Pure Elite, which is also pretty big. I actually don't know if he's uh, a good card or not. Uh, he's a librarian. <laughs> Coral Dragon. And the the other card that I didn't feel like reading. <laughs> Guys, a lot of good hits in this set. Gotta love it. We got good amount of value here. Absolutely crazy amount of value. So if you guys enjoyed this, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next video.